Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Today, I would like to talk about Troyan Beans that took as that are a fan, a detection record I received from Microsoft Defender. This detection name reflects a remote access Troyan that is currently active in your system. In this video, I will explain the dangers of Cassidy Troyan, how it could get into your system, and show how to remove it. So, the first question is, what is Cassidy Troyan? A quick rummaging through malware analysis platforms, namely Virus Tattle and Triage, shows that Microsoft primarily uses this name for remote access Troyans. Their name is self-explanatory, such malware provides remote access and is often used for reconnaissance and delivery on other malware, which is in fact the main payload of the attack chain. But how dangerous is all this? Remote access droids, or RATs for short, typically do not collect a lot of personal data, though the very essence of RATs does not restrict its master from grabbing specific data from your disk. Some of the reviewed CASET samples were model, meaning that hackers can dynamically plug in the modules they need, including one for extensive data collection. But aside from privacy dangers, one thing all the reviewed samples share is malware delivery. CASET can deliver effectively any malware, but most of the time it deploys spyware, ransomware, and things like that. If the initial data collection shows that the system is related to a corporate network, frauds can deploy more advanced tools for lateral movement and malware spreading. And this is what makes it so dangerous. Guess that may be key to wreaking havoc on both home users and corporations. Now, a few hints on how it finds its way to the system. Remote access trains like Gazette are often used in targeted attacks, meaning that they are spreading aimed at a specific person. Their hands, spear phishing emails is a primary way to deliver it. Still, nothing stops cybercriminals from using other methods like infecting pirated software or using malvertising. Rats are flexible enough to fit any of those options. That being said, let's move on to the removal. It is now obvious that Casdetroin is an exceptional dangerous thing, but it is not that easy to get rid of. Such malware creates a lot of backup entries and around the system, so deleting one will not affect its operations at all, and the rest will recover the lost part in a matter of minutes. To deal with such tricky malware, I recommend using Gradient Soft and Time Malware. This program has an advanced detection system that will easily uncover and repel all the miasmas cast it spawns around the system. Run a full scan and let it finish. It would take around 15 minutes. When the program finishes the scan, click the Clean Now button to get rid of the detected items. Depending on the amount of detection, this may also take several minutes. Now the system is clean. Good luck and stay safe online.